what's good y'all it's the elixir we are back with yet another video and in today's video we are going to be talking about which true mode is best in type so we got true let's we got true vasto and we got true visor but which one lands on top guys we're going to be finding out in this video and talk about how to know which variant you have as well and then ranking them all from the best to worst if this video helps you out in any way or you just enjoy the content smash that like button and subscribe to the channel i'm so close to 10,000 subscribers and i'm giving away a true hogyoku link in the description without further ado let's get straight into this video man all right boys let's go ahead and start off first with knowing what every single true mode does starting with true let's guys we got boost we got blood and siphon these are the three variants that you could get as a let's user and i'm gonna go ahead and tell y'all what they do boost variant gives you but this is the one i have and i think it's pretty insane it gives you reatsu regen which we need in this game because of the insane nerf of reatsu that they did damage buff speed buff and defense buff but we do not get percentages like true vasto does which is the only weird thing but only the devs will know how much this really buffs us and then we have blood which is it bluffs your blood vein which is kind of like the equivalent to hiero but it's a little bit more powerful and you get a hyper armor for your um your special move for let's guys so the easiest way to know if you have blood is literally just use this move and if you have hyper armor you'll know you have the blood variant which i don't think is that great of a variant but some people use it some people find it good and then last but not least we have the siphon all damage you do restores some reatsu while in let's this one is pretty helpful as well because once again the reatsu nerf stealing reatsu and regenerating reatsu builds up a charge once that charge maxes out you'll burst with reatsu pause pushing everyone away and restoring a chunk of your reatsu and blood vein so siphon is actually pretty good your charge is represented by a highlight color blah 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 so i think it's pretty obvious guys boost is definitely the one on top here you get that reatsu regen still damage buff speed buff and defense buff why would you not want boost so for true let's definitely boost is gonna be the top then maybe siphon or maybe blood who knows but let's go ahead and go over true vastacar now for true vastacar we got regen which was known to be the top the peak of the pinnacle bro but they nerfed it like three times unfortunately you get 1.1 per tick of passive regen in combat so yes guys you do heal while you're in combat and a lot of people will still argue that this is one of the best variants you can have as a true vasto but me personally it's honestly okay and sarah oscaris regains a percentage of your hp as well and drains your enemies reatsu but most people most people block sarah oscaris on the most part and then we got hiero bro they just nerfed it get rid of this bro i'm pretty sure they didn't update it you get a max of 31 hiero and let me explain to y'all if you're a good player if you're relatively nice at the game your hero is going to last forever. You're never going to be out of here because every single hit, every M1, if you hit a Bala Barrage, which is like, I think 15, like 15 hits, you will get a hero per tick you do. And then you get a 15% defense boost and a 10% damage boost. But they just nerfed the defense boost to 7%, bro. They did Hiero dirty, I ain't gonna lie. And Sarah Oscaris has hyper armor, which is actually pretty OP because you could literally just spin around and aim it wherever your player is going. And then last but not least, we got the dodge variant. Honestly, this might be least, but you get one dodge per 50 seconds. I'm pretty sure they updated it and it is 45 seconds. And dodge refreshes when Sarah Oscaris lands. So this is the only good thing. Let's say you use a dodge and then you're able to land a Sarah Oscaris. You'll get another dodge without waiting the 45 seconds. And then it gives your flash step a buff by 5. Which honestly isn't going to be that big of a deal. And how you will know you have this is you'll have a little aura around you when you do have your dodge. And this is probably the shittiest one. I'm not going to lie to you guys. A lot of people will argue and say dodge is pretty good. But all someone has to do is M1 you and then they could just go back to fighting you. So it's really honestly not that good. Now True Visor is a little something special bro. You get three variants. Not just one of the variants. Or you don't just get a variant and it has a couple buffs. 
you get three variants. You can roll and have three of these, with the first one being Health Regen has a constant 1.1% tick of healing, which is the same as the true Vasta Regen. But mind you, you only get the true Vasta Regen at the time of um it's by itself but with true visor you can have three of them then we have Riatsu regen which gives you six percent ray regen that's pretty crazy if you ask me we got the speed one gives your flash step a buff by three walking speed is increased as you can see here you're a lot faster than other players and then we have the damage buff which is a 10 percent buff and then we have the defense buff which is 10 percent as well so technically it's kind of could match up with the Hiero true Vasakar variant besides the Hiero part, but with the defense and the damage. But you can roll for three of these, which is actually insane. But the only thing about true Visor and true Let's is you don't have it at all times. And with true Vasto, you have these buffs at all times, guys. This is why Visor and Let's do get a little bit more of a buff than Vasto because Vasto has it at all times. And you actually have to build up a bar in order to do it for Visor and Let's. Now, before deciding which one truly is on top, we're going to figure out which one is the best for their own true mode. With true Vasicar being Hiero, hands down, I know a lot of people, a lot of elite players will agree with me with this, even with the little nerf that it took because Regen took some nerfs. And then true Visor, you can't really put a finger on it because you get three of them. But we'd probably go with health regen, Rayatsu regen, and speed or damage. Definitely damage. And then or or defense would actually be pretty OP too to have HP regen and defense, honestly. And then true let's hand down boost is the best one. You get ray regen, damage buff, speed buff, and defense buff. But which one lands on top? Now guys, I'm gonna go ahead and keep it a buck with you. Even though I do main Vastacar, I don't think it has the best true mode. Even though Hiero is amazing and goes pretty insane because you do have it at all times. But unfortunately, I'm going to have to go ahead and give it over to True Visor. And the reason being is, is that... Now, reason being is that you get three of them, and not only that, it's not that hard to get variant rerolls anymore. As you can see here, I think they cost like 750 Robux or something crazy. Yeah, bro, you gotta spend damn near $10 just to get a variant reroll, but now you can play 2v2s, and I've gotten a ton of them by using the 2v2 method, guys. I have a video on that if you wanna check it out. And you pretty much get to choose whatever you want. You could have an HP buff. You could have Rayatsu rebuff. You could have damage. You could have speed. You can literally make it go with any build. But for Vastacar, you kind of have to just settle down on that one buff. And you do get it at all times. And which is why I said Hiero is pretty insane before the nerf. And then let's sure the speed and the no honestly it just can't keep up bro boost cannot keep up with the rest of them and popping let's is pretty cool you do get the arrow moves we got to keep that in mind you get the arrow moves for visor you get those buffs and you get all your moves to um be black you get the little visor arrow and then let's you get your arrows and you get the high leg flag whatever you want to call it but i think it's going to go in order from true visor being on top true vasto being second and speed boost or just boost true let's being in dead last but not by too much because honestly this hero nerf has done us pretty dirty i'm not gonna lie to you guys but true visor just stands on top you could literally just go with any build you want you don't have to be specified to go one way and have specific buffs and rayatu regen and hp regen and a damage damage buff bro or a defense buff like that just sounds crazy in general that you get a choose and just go crazy with that so true visor definitely is the best let me know if you guys agree in the comment section down below and debate with me guys don't just be talking crazy and just being like oh he doesn't know what he's talking about just let me know in the comment section what your thoughts are on this and i'm gonna catch you on the next one man smash that like button smash that sub button true hog giveaway at 10 thousand subscribers join the link in the description we be in the vc all the time as well as always it's elixo peace